Hi humans. I called you humans instead of ladies and gentlemen because I think that we should identify ourselves as humans before our genders. Actually, everything starts with separating genders and determining roles for them. As we determine roles, certain things take shape like boys don't cry and girls cannot do sports. And this creates the discrimination between the genders. Especially in 19th century, movements against gender discrimination started to form. And the ideology that supports gender equality become important. This ideology is feminism. And a person who supports feminism is a feminist. Actually, those two words are dangerous words to use nowadays because People think that feminists are ugly and single women who are full of hatred towards men, which is not true, obviously. However, I admit that I am a feminist. I'm proud of it. Actually, I wasn't a feminist four years ago. I was just like a boy. I'm proud of it. Being like a boy is not the problem here. The problem is I was ashamed of being like a girl. It was because people around me were saying that don't run like a girl, don't kick like a girl, don't punch like a girl, don't cry like a girl. And this made me be like a boy. So I became like a boy. However, as I grew up, I changed my mind. Not because I was thinking that being like a boy is something bad, but being like a girl is something I have to be proud of because girls can do things as well as everybody else. For instance, I am being crazy and I have matches with boys and girls. I have seen some girls who can fight better than some boys. Also, I have seen some boys who can fight better than some girls. So, I understood that gender is nothing about being successful. I mean, being successful is just about how hard you work. As I understood this, I shared my ideas with the others. And they asked me, are you a feminist? And I said, yes, of course, I'm a feminist. But you know what? I didn't know the meaning of feminism. So I searched. As I searched more, I supported more. Then I continued to share my ideas with the others. But people called me feminist, started to call me feminist, which is weird, because they were calling me feminist just one minute ago, and then they started to call me feminist. But I know why they call us feminazi. Because we feminists support women's rights more than men's rights. It's because 92% of rape victims are women. Do you know how much women murders increased in the last seven years? 400%. We support women's rights more than men's rights because Özgecan Aslan, Tipabaka, Sarari Sierra, Gürdünya Tören, Ayşe Palalı, and thousands of women were killed by men. In Turkey, 409 women were killed last year. Government tries to prevent this with pink buses, which is the most sexist thing I have ever seen. One of the governments say women shouldn't go outside after 3 a.m. They should sit and behave properly like a lady. No one can limit women like this. Also, no one can limit men. They can cry in public. They can dance. They can show their emotions to the others. They can do housework and they can do everything they want. Because, because we are all free and actually that is what feminism supports. Finally, as my favorite Prime Minister, Justin Trudeau, said, we shouldn't be afraid of the word feminist. Men and women should use it to describe themselves anytime they want. Thank you.